across the, I would say United States, but shit, we worldwide with this shit. Yes, sir. Everybody across the world, I don't know what time it is, the day or the night that you're tuning in, but we would like to welcome you to the sports podcast that they have started to call Broken Play. Here we have Reggie Ball to my right. We have Marcel. I never know Marcel last name. It's good. We have him to my right. We have Thad in the back where he's going to stay. We have Yvette to the left. And we have Greg ducked off. And Dom is in his director seat. Have some troubling news. Anybody who betted with the 49ers, you're in trouble. If Pat Mahomes' daddy done got locked up, nigga, it's up. <laughs> nigga, that was all Pat Mahomes needed to see. You want to lock my daddy up before the Super Bowl? Man, nigga, please. Oh, man, he finna go throw for 600 yards, nigga. 600. See, man, I, man, I got to stop, bro, because they told me don't put this out. Pat Mahomes' daddy said, you thought he was goddamn had a DWI, DUI, whatever you want to call it. If you thought he had one last week, he said, please do not follow him after the Super Bowl. <laughs> he said he going to have all that shit on him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no. Nah. Well, I think they targeted that man, man. What you think, Reggie? Sound about right. I mean, you know... Uh... He's a high-profile guy. Talk a lot of shit. You yeah. know what I mean? He, he, they're at the top of the game. Uh, his son going back for, I think, number three, right? Yeah, for sure. Back-to-back. Uh, -back. So uh, he, he's under that spotlight, man. So he definitely got eyes on him. So that that didn't happen by mistake. But you got to be a little more careful. Yeah, because it's not his first offense. Like, right. It's, like it's, <laughs> right. his third time. Hard to defend know. that. Yeah, but this is the first time like it hit the media like that, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never. Yeah. Because I they never put it out like that. You know, I think it's the time. I think it's the time. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's time. Yeah. But my thing is, bro, what you would want him to do? Like, as a dad, bro, my son going to another Super Bowl. And, and let's let's shine a light on this. We ain't never saying we want people to drive drunk or That's nothing right. like that. But I'm glad nobody got hurt. But, nigga, he's celebrating his son. If you have, if you have a goddamn strong-ass Red Rock ginger ale, <laughs> you blow. You will get it, man. Them red rocks in the red be strong as a motherfucker. You will get it to you. You blow off that shit. Ginger is strong, dog. Nigga don't realize. So who knows if he really was drunk? I don't know. I'm not gonna say he was. Shit, but if he want to celebrate his son, let him celebrate his motherfucking son, man. Yeah, I'm with you on that. Yeah, he was released on ten thousand dollar bond. Man, that ain't nothing. shit. He probably had that on. Nothing. He had Straight that cash, on. homie. Nigga, you got to know who we talking about. You don't think he bending in the stand? He bending on first downs. His dad is a real nigga. He got to keep a 20 on him. Just to bet. I like my son right here for a first down. Who? <laughs> he got to show it. He probably, man, he probably tried to pay the officer. Like, man, I'm Pat Mahomes in. You see the name on the license? You see my name on the license? <laughs> Nigga probably riding around with his baseball jersey on. They kicking <laughs> shit. I fuck with Pat Mahomes. See, get that nigga a Super Bowl commercial. Word. It's on know. the way. Yeah. Let him win. Him it's and his daddy. Way. Yeah, Pat, that's what you do. Put your daddy in one of them all state commercials, nigga. We want to see more of Pat Mahomes senior. Nobody want to see you and Kelsey, nigga. <laughs> Kelsey ain't got no motherfucking. Then they already done talking about it. They done gave Kelsey the haircut, the face. Oh, yeah, that was crazy. Hold on, I missed that one. Yeah, it's a whole, oh. news, a whole news cycle about, like, Barbara saying, get into Kelsey. No. Kelsey's like, nah, bro, this this is not my shit. Like, this is a fade, bro. It's been out for a long time. Like, mm. y'all tripping. But yeah, that's crazy. The shit. white news, man. But they not used to the shit, but they like, bro, when, when now at Supercuts, it's finna be a whole, <laughs> it's finna be a whole frenzy. Now the whole Barbara chart finna change. Yep. <laughs> It's gonna be Kelsey all on that motherfucker, boy. I believe different, it. different side. I different believe side, it. yeah. Don't showing different sides, man. <laughs> Super Bowl Sunday. It's the biggest night. This is what everybody been waiting for. You got 17 weeks plus the preseason plus the post. Hey, it's hey. This is what all of it come down to. Come on, man. It gets no bigger than this. If you're not on prize picks right now, forget the sideline. Forget the game. 
You got to be on prize picks just for Sunday. This way, this way it counts. If you've been losing all year, this way you get your big win at. I don't care if you down to your last $3.19. This way you get it back. And if you ain't never signed up, this way you always could come through. Anything you put up to $100, they going to match it. Where you going to do that at? On Super Bowl? They offering this? All you got to do is put the code broke in play, and you going to win some money on Super Bowl Sunday? Forget the halftime show. Halftime, you can make another wager and get second half. Say, say they ain't do nothing all first half. Second half, they got to do something. Maybe they need to usher to pump them up. Maybe they need to they hear that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now they ready. Take Debo Samuel. Over receiving, over rushing, it's Super Bowl. He finna show out. Pat Mahomes, you know we don't pick nothing less. We don't disrespect Pat Mahomes. Take more for him. Super Bowl Sunday. Ain't no better way than we popping 1942 on the last football game of the season. This when it matter. It's available in over 30 states. But if you out there in Las Vegas for the game, unfortunately, you can't do it out there. Drive your ass to Arizona. Put your wages in, man. Come on, let's go get this prize pick money. Go to prize pick right now. And if you done signed up, get somebody in your family to sign up. Then you split the, you split the money with them. Start thinking. Come on. Broken play. Promo code. Let's get this money. Super Bowl Sunday. But in good news that you're saying, it is Super Bowl week. It's time to lock the fucking. Trying to lock in, bro. I need a winner. It's been tough. So the bed lines changed. How, how? They didn't change. It didn't change. Nah. It's still one and a half Niners um, plus one and a half Chiefs. Now, opinion. this is what we got to figure out. Has what's what's the majority of the public going with? Can you see that? Shit. Some some sites will show you that. Yeah, but I don't. Now, I, I got to pay for that. No, nah, nah, you ain't got to. Nah, show, some yeah, of them. Some of them show. I don't know which ones. I'm gonna tell you that. But yeah. some of them do show you what 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 side is uh, heavily favored or where the most of the money is going. Yeah, but I'm telling you now, bro. I I, I would just have to take Pat Mahomes money. Come on, man. <laughs> You can be a fool not to. Hey, yeah. The 49ers, you win, you win. But I just I just win bet against Pat, bro. They've been underdogs the whole postseason, right? Whole po whole season. Shit. Yeah. Whole season when they had that little rocket start. Yeah. Niggas start counting them out. I'm seeing 70%. 70% who? Of the money of Kansas City. I don't know, dog. That's on different. That's on, <laughs> that's on Bet MGM on DraftKings. Yeah, the only on, thing, on, yeah. the only thing though, a lot, you gotta think. A lot of people see they they like shit. I don't know who you think got a better defense. I say this: Baltimore or Forty Nine ers. Who you think got a better defense? Shit. Baltimore the Forty Nine ers. Yeah, they about naked Nick. Ain't too much. Ain't ain't too much separation yeah, between like one and two. Baltimore. San Fran or Kansas City right now. Kansas City defense going crazy. Yes, they are. They don't get en they don't get enough credit. But I'm trying yeah. to see what they seeing. Well, we won't change the line. We still got the 49ers flavor. Cause you remember we saw this with Michigan. That's how Manny kind of explained with the Michigan uh Washington game. Mm -hmm. But shit, sometimes Vegas just don't get it right. But I doubt they lose like that. They were like, shit, we got enough money from these niggas. <laughs> no, All them niggas bet it with Lamar Jackson. Jackson. They ain't gonna never say that, bro. Oh shit! <laughs> Kadarius Tony say he is number one receiver when he gets the ball. Kadarius Tony, instead of y'all chasing around Pat Mahomes Senior, get that boy checked out. <laughs> get Kadarius Tony the fuck checked out. Test that nigga for cocaine power. <laughs> <laughs> Man, <laughs> bro, can we just get a little highlight reel of all Kadarius Tony fuck ups while I'm talking? Look, bam, <laughs> bam, <laughs> bow, just, just play this on the clip while he talking. Like Tony, 
bro, just it's Super Bowl week. Nigga, just, hey, bro, get you a ring and shut the fuck up. Hey, man. Oh, now, bro, we all, when, when you go saying you the number one receiver, nigga, <laughs> nigga, how? When? Where? Where? What's the five W's the English <laughs> used to say? Yeah. When, what, who, where, why? <laughs> Shut up. Nigga, the least you could have did was go take Pat Mahomes senior charge. <laughs> That's how you show you the number one receiver, nigga. Would have been the best catch Helping of the, the season. Helping the quarterback out. Reggie, Reggie said that's the best catch it you would have been the best season. catch of all season for him. <laughs> Straight up, man. I ain't going to dwell on that too long. Because that's stupid. I don't even know all they receivers, but I know Tony ain't one. Rasheed White, Rice, he been. And that's the one. Four, oh, right? Yeah. Number four. Yeah. yeah, number four, he, he ball. Yeah. Shit, Kelsey a tight end, but that's your number one receiver. Yeah, pretty much. Nigga, yeah. we talk a lot about Pacheco running the ball. Nigga, he's a better receiver than you, Tony. For real? Factual. This year at least. Nigga. I got the um most bet player props. Uh-huh. Um, it's Brock Purdy over 12 and a half rushing yards. Isaiah Pacheco over 66 and a half rushing yards. Uh, Travis Kelsey over 70 and a half receiving yards. And Brock Purdy to throw an interception. And McCaffrey to rush over 87 and a half rushing yards. So those are some most betting props right now that people are betting on. And they own that. I think this broke after we uh, shot our episode. Washington Commanders hired Dan Quinn as head coach. Man. I, I, I'm... I don't know where these franchises are going. These organi- organizations are going. Just recycling these coaches, man. I don't. I don't get it. This. I guess that's beyond me. But uh, I do like to hire with the uh, the OC. But, really. Uh, I, I like to hire because I like them. I'm, I'm a fan of them. But I don't Fair. like. Yeah, I don't like uh, old boy getting kicked out of there so fast. Yeah. Hey, man, I mean, yeah. And now he really ain't got no job. Right. No. Right, because yeah. everybody, yeah, all the spots. Everybody feel. rocking and rolling. Mm-hmm. He'll he can land somewhere, but it's a demotion. Wherever he goes, it's gonna be a demotion. Which is sad because he dirty ass game. Take your ad back to Kansas City. He chose to leave too, right? He chose to leave, yeah, yeah. yeah. And he did that to better himself to get that, you know, because he's underneath Andy Reid and Andy Reid's calling the play, blah blah blah. But and I think Washington Commanders had a high power. Offense this year. Yeah, they, yeah, they were so young. Points. They're very yeah. young. But look, it's all about, I felt like Andy Reid was going to ha- hand over the reins to him. Andy Reid ain't, oh, who knows how long he want to coach, but shit, I, I thought eventually he'll be like, shit, bro, you can have this yeah, shit. Sooner than later, for sure. Yeah, Sometimes for sure. you just got to get it under, under, underneath that shadow. Yeah, look what they got his ass. Unemployed. Yeah. Maybe ego what, sometimes. What, what do you like about Kingsbury? Uh, Just the innovation. He's coming from the college ranks, and I like everybody everywhere that he's gone. You like you're seeing a lot of what the the players are responding to with the spread type offenses, the 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 optional um, type of reads, if you will. And it's it's just more of a wide open game for the players, the quarterbacks, the receivers, especially. But I just like the numbers he put up. I, if, everywhere you go, everywhere he's been, every quarterback he's had, they they putting up numbers, bro. But they ain't winning, bro. I, I, I mean, it's his third year in the league, I think. Third, fourth. How many? He's how many 28, years? 37, and one as a Cardinals head coach. But the you got to think bro. a lot of that time he didn't have the Cardinals. Uh, that's the Kyle Cardinals. Playing. Yeah, that's the Arizona Cardinals, bro. We talking about a franchise. I, I don't, come on, bro. I understand the numbers. But he hasn't and, been yeah. that successful wherever he's been. Even at Texas Tech when he had Pat Mahomes, they weren't that good. They were an average team in the, the Big 12. Again, you're talking from an offensive state of mind, numbers. They put no points. Mahomes got some records that you that probably won't ever be touched again as far as throwing the ball, passing yards, uh, and passing touchdowns in the season. Um, he set the bar as far as just running up the score, running up the yards. Again, it all comes down to wins and losses. I mean, wins and losses. Yeah, I agree with that, but... But he's not in that position because he's an OC now. Right. But he was an OC at – he's coming from USC. He was Caleb Williams' head, uh, OC at USC. And we all said Caleb Williams kind of had a down year this year. Yeah, but, hey, that, I still like him, That was like a power him, move. It's a power move. I, that, and you know how that shit go, bro. Like, it's, it's, it's the numbers game. Uh, 
he's favored some way, somehow. You know what I mean? You call it what it is. Because, again, what's my boy's name from uh, Kansas City? Um, Eric. Eric. Yeah. He didn't, they didn't do bad. Sam Howell actually looked good. He had a lot of bright spots this past season. You know what I'm saying? But again, bro, it's, this is this is still a business at the end of the day. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a power move to get Caleb. The Come few on now. Games I you think watched, so? The few games I watched Washington, Eric play calling is still like, he's still innovative with his shit. Like he's sprinkling some of those trick plays and Not all stopping. that. You're right. But you remember LaShawn McCoy had that, uh, he talked about him. He said he don't know how to talk to players. Mm. So I don't know if that got something to do with it. But damn, Dan Quinn didn't get that nigga a shot. Yeah, he's like, I respect you, but I'm going this. I'm going this route. Yeah, I don't and even want to try. It. It's like they they went that route. It seems like to try to get Caleb to come to Washington. They got the number two pick. They may trade up to go number one. Who knows? But that that you makes might sense. just hit. You might just hit it that right makes on the sense. head, bro. That that yeah, that clears. That's the exactly out of what the fuck they doing. Yeah, and Caleb posted a picture of his coach, like he said, "Congrats, gang!" Like this is dope. Oh yeah, yeah. He posted there. It is stuff. that nigga been Washington. <laughs> There it you, is. You just me from the oh, oh, that's a wrap. Just all the right. motherfucking right, good. Case. And he's screaming. He's been screaming for the longest. I don't want to go to Chicago. Yeah, yeah facts. They don't want his ass there anyway. They don't want him in Chicago. What a few niggas I know. <laughs> 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 I ain't talking about the organization. <laughs> Carl Weathers, man, aka Apollo Creed. If you know about Rocky, nigga, this hurts me, bro. Yeah. Cause I know the movie called Rocky. But I always wanted Apollo to whoop his ass, bro. I always was Apollo Creed <laughs> fan. The nigga was flashy in the ring. You know what I mean? Yes, yeah. he was. Yeah, I ain't never see that. Dylan from The Predator. What else Y'all you Y'all ain't seen The Predator? Yeah, oh. it's been a while, though. Oh, okay. I know you're talking about. That's one of my favorites. He was in Mandalorian man. recently. Um, he probably been dope. in all that in the heat of the night shit. He probably yeah, know. Yeah, fake, I didn't know he the played fake in the league. Arm in Happy Gilmore. That's right. Yeah, fake he played yeah. in the league. Yeah, he played for the Raiders. For real? Would, mm-hmm. NFL. Yep. I linebacker, didn't know that. I believe. Yeah, linebacker a few years. Damn, squished over acting. And ain't looked back since, man. Yeah, man. Well, big RIP to Apollo, I mean, uh, Carl Weathers, a.k.a. Apollo Creed, man. Man. What does Adonis do now? Who? Adonis Creed. Who is that? <laughs> oh, oh, boy. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> nigga, I ain't never know him first name, nigga. I just knew the movie Creed. Creed. I'm like, who the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I said, nigga, I stopped watching Rocky after three. I don't know about the mother, nigga. <laughs> I forgot Creed was about that, man. Best and worst Super Bowl of all time. To me, I would say the best Super Bowl I ever seen, bro. I would have to say Seattle versus uh, New England. Seattle versus that New was crazy. Yeah, when uh, oh, Russell man. threw that pick, Hell nah, that was oh man. <laughs> but I'm just saying it was a it was a oh shocking moment type that of shit. Crazy. Yeah, that made me mad. Uh, let me think. Or either St. Louis versus Tennessee, one of the two. That was one of the ones for you. When they beat the yeah, yeah. Beat yeah. Tyree, that's, that's, uh, that's my favorite. Under the Patriots team. Uh, that's my favorite. Also, Janet Jackson um, halftime show with the Carolina and the Patriots. I never forget that. That was pretty. That was pretty awesome. Man, I be- <laughs> I was a young nigga, Ninth but grade. I've been watching porn, so that shit didn't do nothing for me. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that's it for uh, real. Like, come yeah. on, bro. that's Janet Jackson. Though. Hey, let the pants drop. <laughs> Those are my top two. <laughs> Let that market hang. <laughs> uh, worst Super Bowl. Respectfully. Pro- respectfully. Worst Super Bowl would probably be that Patriots and Rams Super Bowl that was here. That shit was, that shit was horrible. Oh, hell yeah. The, the freeze storm. Bro. That one? When it was cold as hell outside? No. No, when it was uh, in Atlanta. Patriots and Rams. Rams when it was golf and Todd Gurley against that Patriots team. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn, it's almost, yeah. I almost forgot about that. That was, bro, that was boring. That was boring. It's like 17 to 13. Right. Then, um, when, uh, Lynn, uh, no, that was yeah, amazing. Nah. That was good. Yeah, oh, my that boy was good. took uh, Harrison to the yeah, house. Yeah, 97 yards or something like that. Well, that was a good one. No, that <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm not saying that, that was a good a, Super Bowl. Yeah, that was a good Super Bowl. We ain't talking about what was bad for you, nigga. We talking about bad, like, that was a crazy like, thing. boring to watch. 
Born to Watch. Yeah, um, that's Super Bowl. Was I would say crazy. that Carolina versus uh, Denver. That shit was boring to watch from beginning to end. That shit went no, shit. No, uh, Denver versus Seahawks when Seahawks killed them. Oh, I like watching that, that though. You did? Yes, I did. For real? I like because they went crazy. That that team, that Seattle team, might be one of the best. Yeah, they should have went back about, to back. Exactly. They yeah. had that motherfucker I, back to back. You know, Peyton Manning was at the top of the mountain at that time, so to see them just whoop their ass, it was it was kind of satisfying. Oh yeah, that's the one you you flip, yeah, yeah. So it's been some good. I think this this should be a good. Yes, Super Bowl. Do you think this will have a a good outcome? This one, uh, the yeah. last one. Ah, right, it's gonna be a classic, good. bro. This is gonna be a classic. I really do think this is this going down. This is gonna be one. Of the you ones. you got the characters you want. You got exactly. Debo, huh? Yeah, yeah, you got Debo out there, man. You got Pat. And Kelsey, Taylor Swift gang. It's just a whole lot of things yes. going on the, the there. The number 13. You been yeah. seeing that shit online? What number 13? Like Taylor Swift's favorite number is 13. All this shit adding up to 13. It's 13 hours from Tokyo to the Super Bowl. Like it's been is some that what dumb shit. Hey. coming from or something? Marcel, yeah, it's, it's been oh, some dumb fuck. shit. You taking that research shit too far. <laughs> This some shit I would not have want to know. I don't give a fuck about Man, I'm thinking you finna say something. I'm thinking some shit. 13 hours of Tokyo. What the fuck that got to do with the Super Bowl? She flying from Tokyo. To go. Man, I don't give a fuck where that bitch flying from. The game's on the 11th. 2 plus 11 is 13. I hope oh, no Taylor Swift damn. fans watch this show at all. A job bitch will come with that fuck shit on the page. Speaking of coming some fuck shit. Y'all motherfucking crazy. Y'all had Najee mad as a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did that shit? Uh, did it upload faster? Yeah, he got, he got the uh, episode <laughs> up faster, so it's work. working. There you go. <coughs> it working. Damn, boy. Y'all crazy as a motherfucker. That nigga Najee was mad about that shit, boy. <laughs> that nigga gonna start watching the episodes now. <laughs> And he, gonna start, he gonna start editing that shit itself. Hey, I saw y'all motherfucker with DMing me, bro. The Kwame Brown uh interview is will be dropping soon. Shut the fuck up. You said that shit was quick as hell. N- nigga talk, oh, nigga yeah. DM okay. me. Damn, that's fucked up, bro. You <laughs> I thought you were realer than that. You ain't even let the man speak. Uh you were scared he was going, man, I ain't scared of shit, nigga. I <laughs> shit on the app. <laughs> The interview coming, motherfucker. <laughs> it dropped on the app already? Nah, it ain't dropped. Oh, yet. I was about to say, you can tell who got the app and who don't. Nah, it ain't dropped yet. The NBA, they cheating the shit out of Trey Young, man. Yeah, that was a crazy Damn shame. Oh, shout out to Bud Dupree, man. Nigga sent the jersey in like a real nigga. Hell yeah, Bud. Hey, I told nigga we gonna get it. First 48. We gonna get it. Remember Bella? <laughs> <laughs> on the way. It's on the motherfucking way. This is a game jersey, too. Yeah, game worn. It's just oh, signed. Man. We don't get, and we don't get renewed for season three. That bitch will be at the crib. <laughs> <laughs> get me a frame for that motherfucker. Nah, shout out to him. Man, yeah, but Trey Young, man, I don't know what they got against Trey Young. Why y'all don't fuck with him? Bro. Bro, ain't no way he ain't in the All Star game. Twenty seven and ten, past two years, but Eastern Conference got some killers at guard, man. Of course, Marcel. I'm not. I'm not saying they don't. But Trey Young, if we if we just talking numbers, yeah, and we talking popularity, that nigga is in both. He had the second highest votes in the East as a, between anyone. That may be his guy. I can't name me the guard. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, who who in there? Uh, but he balling. He's been shit, bro. hooping. He balling, bro. No, name me the guard. He you want you want to name he me balling. the reserves? Yeah, or name everybody? me the reserve. Name me the reserves that are guards. Yeah, Brunson, Maxi, Mitchell, Donovan. Get Mitchell, Mitchell yeah. out of there, bro. Mitchell, I'll they're, they're Mitchell. third in the East. They're number they're two. Th- they're second. Wait, in the what's East. his numbers? Points, rebounds. And he's carrying I find his numbers. Bro. So okay, so because Embiid ain't gonna put Embiid out. Okay, tell me this. But still, like it's still. Uh, none of them niggas y'all name 
are bigger stars than Trey Young. No, sir. No, they're not. No. And when I say that, she, them niggas ain't even got a shoe. Trey Young got a shoe. <laughs> Donovan has no, a I'm shoe. No, I'm saying we can't judge it Donovan by that. Donovan Mitchell I'm saying, has a shoe. He Trey had a Young shoe before Trey. Super, I ain't never seen no nigga with no Donovan Mitchell shoe. <laughs> you not a hooper. Hey, nigga, if I was, I'd be like, what the fuck Please you got on? Please put on a shoe when you can. Yeah, I want to see them. Why the too, fuck bro. you got on some Donovan, Donovan Mitchell? Donovan got some nice kicks. I ain't though. picking no nigga wearing no Donovan Mitchell. <laughs> I don't seen Trey Young's shoe. Niggas will rock that. How he chasing them? That's just that's, he don't chase. Nah. You don't chase a stitch. Nah, bro. Oh, he don't, he yeah, don't. it's he, that padding, bro. No, nah, he don't. <laughs> when he come off that pick and roll, bro, he see what's open. Either he got damn take or he drop it off. That's all he doing. He gonna hear you talking about him. No, you know, but, hey, I already know when he see that so they gonna be like, man, I gave that fuck nigga a hundred dollars and call that, that fuck nigga kill him. <laughs> and he wanna kill me, <laughs> man. Trey Young allowed to slap your ass, man. Hey, Dom, can you please cut this out? <laughs> <laughs> nah, we editing this shit, man. Let Trey hit. <laughs> Trey, be careful when you get a hundred too, man. These <laughs> niggas ain't real. <laughs> Give me a hundred, nigga. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah, it, and cool. Trey Young just got Eastern Conference Player of the Week. He, they've been the Hawks been hooping, man. They um Lakers beat Lakers, Suns, thirty one points, State. eleven assists, sixty four percent behind three point. Mm-hmm. What game? Which game? Nigga, that for the week. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> there ain't no game. That's the motherfucking week. Yeah, yeah, they've been hooping. So look, Hawks have been doing better. Do they still get rid of uh, Dejounte? Dejounte. Man, I hope not. I like going to the game watching them. You like watching Jonte? Yeah, yeah. They need a big. Get rid of Capella. Shit, who want Capella, nigga? Nobody. <laughs> you could he get rid now. of him. Wait, for what? Capella do what he's supposed to do. Pick yeah. and roll and throw a lob. He, he, he averaged a yeah. double-double, right? <laughs> he 10 to uh, 10. I don't know. I don't, the Hawks are in a very interesting predicament, man, because you, you hear rumors about trade. My, don't want to be there. Like he bought a house in L.A. He wanted to play. He he loves how Wimby plays. You hear rumors about them trading Dejounte, but those this past week they've been really like hooping. There's but potential I'm trying there, to figure out is them niggas really cool though? I never really see them niggas well, interact. It is, but it don't matter. No, I'm saying yeah, yeah. I don't I don't see them niggas cool on the court though. Find us a clip of them niggas even just dapping up after a play. Yeah. Yeah, 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 After they do something good, them niggas walk separate ways. Them <laughs> niggas don't Like when ja- DeJounte hit that, ge- when he looked off Trey, when they played the Magic and hit that game winner, I- Trey's energy is like, he wasn't really like hype. Like he was like, oh, that's what's up. <laughs> I'm with you niggas all day, every day. I practice with y'all. I goddamn travel with y'all. Like, I Yeah. Hey, dumb. I agree with you on that. Sometimes you might be around a motherfucker too long. You you don't you can't show you happy all the time. But if a nigga hit a game winning shot, <laughs> I don't give a fuck if I've been around you all fucking year. Nigga, I'm excited you hit the game winning shot. On good teams. On good teams. Like yeah, if saying. I fuck with on you. On good teams, yeah. But if I don't fuck with you, nigga, you could have just you could have won a championship. I'm in the locker room like Kyrie. Cole, we did it. <laughs> he showed you he ain't fuck with LeBron. Where that nigga was at? He wasn't celebrating with LeBron. Mm. You was right, Cole. <laughs> when that happened, like Kyrie didn't even touch the trophy. Damn. Like I remember, because I, I was clipping off, I was clipping off that game for some project, and I'm mm. looking like, yo, Kyrie didn't even touch the trophy, and he like won them that shit. Like LeBron had the trophy the whole time, and like I'm like, bro, that's kind of crazy. That when it probably hit him, he was like, it don't matter what I do. Word facts. This this nigga shit. Yeah, yeah, facts. yeah. So that be the difference with that. So yeah, you uh Trey might get in because you said Embiid. Damn, my, that fucked up. Embiid got hurt, man. That might mess up his MVP. Oh, it is most it's definitely. A wrap. It's a wrap. Most definitely. Because he he Cause most definitely he, he can't miss sixty five. He definitely was back to back. Yeah. The way he's hooping, um, he's averaging more points than minutes. Dang, this year, crazy. Oh shit! So now do it automatically go to Jokic? Uh, SGA hooping. Um, SGA is it's really he going crazy. All right, you throw Luca in there. 
Unless they don't have a better record than OKC? Nah. Hey, that. I'm not mad at you with Luca. I watched that <laughs> motherfucker live. 73. <laughs> Hit 73 on the Hawks. If they want to get it to Luca, get it to him now. And fucking Curry hit 60 on the motherfuckers. Yep. He lost, but 60, like. One damn. thing about it, now any player who feel like they could hoop and score, they can't wait to play the Hawks in Atlanta. <laughs> they were like, bro, it's somebody that'll ring though, bro. That shit like the new Madison Square Garden. Where niggas gonna come with their A game. Okay. Oh, yeah, they Hawks. probably ain't coming fucking around no more. Yeah. It's probably niggas ain't hanging yeah, out no more. You gotta get your sleep. You gotta yeah. get your rest. <laughs> uh-huh. You can't come go to the club and all that All shit. that social media shit out now. It was used to them niggas could goddamn walk out of Magic City and go straight to yeah, the game. <laughs> now with all this paparazzi taking pictures, you can't do that shit. Uh, Clay Thompson not closing games out. He can't. Kaminga is motherfucking balling. I don't know what it is. See, we had Los on the show. Los said it's when niggas grow their hair out. Kaminga is not no nigga. He a, what he is? African. African. He the opposite. When he cut his hair, <laughs> that nigga went motherfucking crazy. So it's some, some shit is reverse programming for niggas. When that nigga cut his shit, boy, <clears throat> that nigga went the He hoop. been going crazy, bro. Yeah. Y'all made me pay attention to him. And he like African for real. Yeah. Well, like, hey, nigga, you hear a land name. No, I'm saying, but sometimes oh. if you Americanize African, oh. like, the way if you hear him speak, like yeah. he African African. Oh yeah, for sure. I seen when he was eating on the bench one day. <laughs> what? <laughs> he was dipping something in. <laughs> I'm like, that boy crazy. Nigga, he can't eat you a snack, nigga. <laughs> that nigga had a full meal on that big green. <laughs> I think it's it something with an F or a foo. I don't know what it's called, but he was the in that foo-foo, shit. Foo-foo, bro. Yeah, that was <laughs> the foo foo. Uh, we had Kwame Brown last week, and Marcel's in here. Both of them said Doc Rivers deserve it. They right. He started off one and three. Uh, <laughs> that's the Doc Rivers I know. Word, they had a horrible loss. They to don't Utah. look good, bro. Utah came back down by twenty and beat. Bro, I know Griffin at the house watching that shit like this. Word. Yeah, I thought that shit was sweet, bro. Doc said he gonna give him that All Star bonus in the ring too. He gonna give. Uh, he said that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he said he's gonna give him that All Star bonus and his uh, All Star ring, which Very is cool honorable. as hell. Yeah, but them boys still look bad. I don't give a damn how nice. That's he is. solid. Let the yes. nigga come to the game and sit on the bench with you, bro. <laughs> My well, let him coach. Bro, I don't understand because Cleveland's number two now. Why can't like Cleveland's head coach be All Star and shit? Man, walking number shit. one. No, they are not. Boston's number one, and yeah. Missoula can't. You can't do back to back years. And at the time, Milwaukee was number two, so Dot became Eastern Conference mm. coach. Now they're they not already got. They already got to buy flights and pay for travel, Marcel. They can't change the shit at the end. Yeah, I feel so. Thad, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. am I lying? <laughs> I don't see my nigga Thad running production, so I know how that shit go. Like you can't just switch up at the last minute, bro. <laughs> Brandon Miller been hooping. Bro, for real, for real. He had like back to back 30 plus point nights. And he been shooting behind that three point line. And he been being a leader. Um, He made a layup. Okay. The first... Hold up. What? Marcel. What? You can't be no damn leader for no sorry. <laughs> you ain't lying. Yeah, man. <laughs> nah. Anybody can be the goddamn leader for the whole. <laughs> nigga, you take your ass down. You will be a leader. <laughs> He ain't been no leader for them niggas, man. <laughs> <laughs> nigga had a good game. Now you can tell them niggas shut the fuck up. They ain't been no leader. You had a good game. I don't want to hear shit he did after he did a layup. <laughs> he been hooping, though. Trade deadline February 8th. Who needs to make a move? The Lakers. Why you say that, bro? It look like they like each other now. Huh. As opposed, uh, uh, you know, opposed to what we said or what you said about the Hawks. Bro. Nah, they got a... F- yeah. Now, I will say that about the Lakers. Lakers got a fake-ass team. <laughs> and when I say fake, I ain't saying they, they some fake niggas. I'm saying they'll dap you up and, and know your ass getting traded tomorrow. They don't care about that shit. Hollywood. Yeah, they just, they just hey, man, look, bro, there's going to be a lot of cameras on. I know I don't fuck with you and you don't fuck with me. <laughs> But you hit that game winning shot, I'm finna hug you. All right, bro. Yeah, Bron don't fuck with D-Lo for real. 
fuck no. <laughs> Bron do not fuck with Don't Jimmy nobody Butler. like him. Bron, every time that nigga hit a shot, Bron be happening like, God damn, that nigga hit another motherfucking week. I count the butter out, too. He balling like hell. They 6-2 and two in the last eight games. Yeah, they balling. Yeah. They lost to the Hawks, though. They should they give up Austin Reeves. Yeah, they man. don't. They won't give him up. I don't know, bro. Why, like, like, we need an all star back. I'm like, bro, he ain't an all star. He nice, but come on, bro. If Austin like, Reeves was black, that nigga would not be in the league. Stop it, Isaiah, <laughs> Isaiah Thomas. <laughs> That's what they said about Bird. Who? Back then. The, who said that about Bird? Isaiah that, Thomas said like, if he was black, if Bird was black, he wouldn't get all the recognition he gets. Now, yeah, right. It He'd went, be dogging, the right? Yeah, still. Now, still. You know hey, I got a new, something though. I got a newfound respect for Larry Bird. <laughs> but he wouldn't be like how they were saying Larry Bird was the best. Like, bro, if you give he wouldn't have got that many that that much of a spotlight if he was black. There you go. In Boston, bro. He wasn't the first player in Boston hooping. He was white. Now there's somebody we could put on TV and say, this our team, this our leader. Nigga, Austin Reeves is not, he cool. Solid. He yeah. not, bro. I could name you ten white players way better than Austin Reeves that done came, and he ain't get this much limelight. He just with the He's Lakers, in LA, bro. Yeah, yeah he up. with LA. That nigga not better than JJ Reddick. He not better than Mike Miller. Nigga, them uh, niggas was hooping. Yeah, they. Um, Austin Reeves like in his third or fourth year. I don't give a fuck, man. <laughs> they should go get Bruce Brown. There you go. Yeah, Toronto. So sure. now look. If we could trade Bruce Brown for Austin Reeves, is Austin Reeves is who you thought he was then? I'm trading that. I'm doing it in the Immediately. Heart. Immediately. Expeditiously. Who? Yeah, Bruce Brown. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? He a valuable trade Why not? asset. Hell yeah. Yeah, that's what they get him for. The team that just traded to get him to get rid of Austin Reeves, we're not saying nah, that for Austin Reeves, but he would yeah. be on the trade block for sure. Yeah. I think someone should be trying to get Grant, Jeremy Grant, for Man. sure. With Malcolm Portland. Brogdon from Portland. They ain't doing shit. They can Bridges, they can win. Get Miles Bridges for sure. He's hooping. Damn, I forgot about He'll him. He'll be a rental, though. Bro. He'll be on a one year. I know y'all love him. <laughs> Jalen Johnson. He's staying. He's, he's nice. He's untouchable. He's, yeah, he's staying. He's not trading him. He ain't not trading him. He's on a rookie contract. Yeah, he's untouchable, bro. Mm. He been hooping. <laughs> I wouldn't say that. But. I know Jalen Johnson like, man, fuck. <laughs> that nigga listen like, God damn, why me? He been hooping, bro. That's Give why they got, this they got rid of John Collins because they knew that what they had within um, Jalen Johnson. Nah, they got rid of John Collins because he was shit. <laughs> damn, man, that nigga had shouted out broken play when, uh, yeah. Shout out to John Collins. <laughs> What's up, John? <laughs> What's up, boy? We miss you, boy. <laughs> Damn, the Hawks <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> Hawks, you can't get shit right. <laughs> How the fuck you let the best thing that ever happened to this organization go? <laughs> speaking, speaking of who fucking with us, man. The whole goddamn broken play squad. Y'all went out there to see uh, Georgia Tech upset oh, yeah. North Carolina. That How that amazing. was, man? It was hard. Yeah. A lot of fun. Yeah, man. Damon Stoudemire said y'all niggas welcome to come back anytime. Yeah, shout out Coach Stoudemire, man. Shout out to Coach Stoudemire. He showed us a great time. Got his tickets in. Reggie Ball got all the love. Oh, yeah. That boy How Reggie that, came in there. Feel? Shaking white hands. Hey, let's see you again. Man. Hugging babies, kissing babies. I'm like, God damn. Like, ball Don't the one. Don't listen to him now. They just putting on. True celebrity. Oh, y'all oh already God. know. You two of it. Yeah. We tried to get on the court. Like, and we like, they wouldn't let us on the court. And then it's like, oh, you with ball? Oh, y'all. Oh, OG's yeah, walking up. Reggie Ball. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> had a nice little satin jacket on. Never seen a jacket like that before. It was a like good time. Before. We had an amazing time amazing. out there with the team, man. It was, it was, it was historic shit. They were, uh, you want to see with number three? Big upset. Yeah, Bro. nobody saw that coming either. We did. From the get-go? Second half. No, nah, second half we did. <laughs> I saw second Reg half, like, we did. We did second right. half, money line, Georgia Tech, bro. Take it. I'm like, I'm a, I'm a UNC fan, right? Yeah. I'm a UNC fan, but I was the Tech fan that day. But that was rock. All UNC fans. It was more UNC bro, fans. Hell yeah. Fans. For that sure. was it was rocking. Yeah. yeah. Whole stadium was powder blue. blue. Yeah. But that game was rocking. 
Who the best Georgia Tech basketball player? All time. All time. Steph. I say Steph. Stephon Marbury. Marbury. Chris, you got to throw who? Chris uh, Bosh up there, too. Yeah. Matt Harper. Oh, dang. Chris Bosh. <laughs> he good, but he ain't up there. Uh, Chris Bosh. Uh, he won. No, he's, 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 mo- he's the most accomplished out of Yeah, he up there, but I'm saying, like, Stephon Marbury was. Niggas forgot. Yeah. Boy, Jared Jack was a dog. He coached him there. Yeah, fine. No, no, the championship. They lost in UConn in the championship. So did. Right. Damn. They make an over for him. Yeah. Y'all remember Derek Favors? Yeah, yeah. yeah, I played against yeah. Derek Favors. Yeah. South Atlanta High School. Yeah. Techner yeah. had some niggas. Shout out my boy Gunny Lawal went there, man. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. 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 But Will Bynum slept on too. I don't know if you know Will Bynum. Dog. Yeah. He was there in Utah. He had no go to Detroit, that was my favorite right? Player, he was there in Utah. Yeah. He's he's short too. Yes. Right? He's, he's from Chicago. Yeah. Did he he's go to uh, Detroit too? He played with Detroit. He played, Detroit, yeah. he played okay. a few teams. Dog, he can jump, bro. Yeah. He uh-huh. like he like he played football. Bro, that was, How that was, was basketball then when you went there, uh, Reggie? That's when we went to the Final Four. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Solid team. Uh, Anthony Morrow, BJ Elder. I see. Shout BJ. out to Anthony Morrow, uh, sniper. Boy, that nigga was yeah. lights out when he get behind. We had Ish. Ish was dunking all over the damn place. Then I don't know if y'all remember uh, Ishmael Muhammad. I believe it was yeah. his name. Uh, number two. That motherfucker uh, was dunking yeah, on everybody. For sure. Bouncy. Uh, we had a good ass squad when I was there. How was like? Campus for during that run, like them, like it was. Oh. How was the city during that run? So during the game we went to, I was telling my best friend that was that was with me about that night when they won that game to go to the final four. That whole Bobby died way shut down. For real, shut, man, we went crazy. I know I we had a good time. Everybody was share outside. Story, share story. Everybody was outside. <laughs> My truck was parked on some some frat boys' line or from some frat house line, and it stayed there till about 10, 11 o'clock the next morning. It was no it was one of the hell no, nah. it was one of the ones. He QB one. It was it was it was one of the ones. <laughs> Niggas know how to use that shit to their advantage, man. Let that nigga would have been a a Kadarius Tony. That motherfucker would have been. <laughs> st- you couldn't find that truck to this day. They had to tow that bitch so far. They would have told that nigga shit to Tokyo. <laughs> right where Taylor Swift gonna be at. <laughs> Juju Watkins dropped 51 points against number four Stanford in a 67 58 win. 51 points? Goodness. Out of 67? She is cold. Goodness. She's different, bro. Every year Goodness. we we seeing a different female just come out of nowhere and just like, hey. Angel <laughs> Reese really been low key lately, ain't she? Been quiet. They've been losing. Yeah. Hey, what what what's about Fly J? What ain't that her name? Yeah, Fly J doing good. She was real though. Angel Reese was nice, but she was never like came far. Yeah. But she was. Yeah. She ain't Juju. We talking about Juju. She ain't Juju. Freshman. I say. Well, I was saying like Juju, like um, Monica from Love and Basketball. And Bronny's like Quincy McCall, just like they go together. <laughs> nah, oh. <laughs> but that's the energy I'm nah. feeling from you. <laughs> see, like Bronny, like, she had 51 points in one game. Bronny has six points in within four, last four games. Like it's not. Monica was always better than Quincy. That's, yeah, that's real rap. I don't know how she lost that game when she said, "Play me for your heart." I'm like, man, you could take this, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> She lost on purpose. She, she blew the she game. She missed the layup, bro. Like Double or nothing. Canelo <laughs> versus Bud is in the works. Give me Bud. I don't give a fuck. Give me Bud right now. Give me Bud right now. That's that's probably going to be the best fight we're going to see for a long time. For a minute. Time. For a minute. Because Tank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On both sides. Unless some just pop out of the blue. You think it'll be like go the distance? Sound like all of them do now. They make them go to distance. Yeah. We're going to take a quick commercial break. When we come back, we got some comments. <laughs> we got some voicemails. Got some highlights and lowlights. Uh, we definitely got some voicemails. Definitely got some voicemails. What? Niggas was telling me the other day at the gym. Uh, worked out with goddamn ball. Niggas come up, they telling me their story. They were like, man, I got to call that number. <laughs> call that motherfucker, man. <laughs> 
when we come back on Broken Play. Yes, sir. We back for the people in the back. We're going to get into some comments. Um, I seen y'all been calling the goddamn uh, gambling hotline. <laughs> What's that word that keep my ass last week, Marcel? An- uh, anonymous. 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 Hip-hop anonymous? <laughs> we going to still keep it anonymous. If you said your name, then that's on you, but we not going to let it be known. So in the comments, we got Plex. Plex said, y'all damn near went six for six. That's tough. And bro, this what it is. We probably would have hit. If they had one of did those free throws, and I kind of fucked the vet up because we thought Murray wasn't going to play. So did. Yeah, so if Murray would have played, mm-hmm. our inside scoop fucked us up over there. <laughs> <laughs> but for Dad to say a nigga ain't going to hit over four free throws, that was tough. I don't Damn. know why the fuck he even went to that section. DeJounte Murray was my original pick. Somebody by the name of Nav Green said, oh, he questionable. <laughs> <laughs> and I had to go with something on the fly. So I hit, I hit free throws, man, and we lost. <laughs> oh, he questionable. <laughs> he questionable. But I, that, I that's the thing. And sometimes, like, you just got to see what niggas are doing <laughs> when they... I see how the young thug feel now doing his court <laughs> thing. When I looked up and seen that nigga doing that, I was like, that don't surprise me. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? That don't surprise me. Nigga don't want to take his own charge. <laughs> hey, bro, we in this bitch together, but hey, you right. I fucked up. I did that. I take the charge. It's my fault. It's my fault you missed your pick. <laughs> e. Smith said, on God, y'all be dropping late, LOL. <laughs> <laughs> Your mom's side, nigga, said, y'all got to get Pat Mahomes' dad on the show. Nigga, we want to. That's Boy, the type of niggas man, we so need. Yeah, man. We That'll need awesome. niggas like that, bro. Niggas who going to come talk that shit. Man, put it out there, bro. Tell Pat them, Mahomes' tell them on. dad. On, man. Hey, most niggas, this is what niggas want to do. They want to get Pat Mahomes on their show. We don't want Pat Mahomes. Nigga, it's nothing you can say. You a winner. We wouldn't mind it, but. We wouldn't mind, but. <laughs> we wouldn't mind, but he got too many brands. He got to be careful what he doing, careful what he say. His daddy could come on this bitch and talk that shit. Everything we want to know. He he might call Andy Reid a fat son of a bitch. Like, I just want niggas who going to keep it real when they sit on that motherfucking couch. Just like with Kwame. Nobody expected him to say, boy, boy is ugly. <laughs> Oh, man, that shit made me laugh too hard. Yeah, because I'm like, where he going at? He was like, he's just not marketable. He's ugly. <laughs> Didn't hesitate at all. Yeah. He ugly. Called his brother uh, ugly. Looked yeah. just like his brother. <laughs> JL said, hey, now, tell Najee don't make us have to come see him by the uploads. He messing with the church's money, my boy. Hey, y'all better leave Najee the fuck alone, man. <laughs> We got this bitch. We got out. We got this goddamn studio locked the fuck up, just in case Najee come up here on the fuck shit. <laughs> Play it by Trey said, "Fuck Najee." <laughs> <laughs> Damn, right after Curtis said, "Man, fuck Najee with four four middle fingers and some laughing emojis." Red said, "Fuck Najee, man, I'm not making shit up." <laughs> Yeah. Hey, you know how fucked up you got to be for niggas to say, man, bring that net back. <laughs> <laughs> Jonathan Woody said, oh, shit, now I've done leveled it up. Bring in the beef. Who? Talking about what? what? What you think they talking about? Oh. Nigga, I ain't beefing with Nazi. That's y'all. Y'all mad that this shit be goddamn loading up late. Jasmine said, Reggie is my new favorite edition. Missing Thad, though. Where do you buy broken play merchandise? Man, the shit coming. We got to get on that. She like light-skinned niggas. Yeah, she like Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. 
Yeah. When she got a type. <laughs> she got a type. We ain't tripping. <laughs> But missing Thad, though, that was... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Camion McLaughlin said, Kwame, LOL. All right. <laughs> Big Daddy Salter. <laughs> Y'all got to get better with these names, man. Y'all barely put baby girl on screen. Hold on. Oh, Big Daddy is hey. <laughs> Boy, baby girl. Any nigga who calls somebody over 25 a baby girl. <laughs> nigga, how old is you, Big Daddy Salter? <laughs> I'm going to call you BDS. <laughs> nah, because you don't know what the BD can stand for. <laughs> I'm going to call you Salter, nigga. <laughs> like, yeah, because y'all always pausing shit, so I don't know. I, I ain't say it, bro. <laughs> Salter said says, y'all barely put baby girl on screen. And then when you do for a motivational speech, we get this weak ass camera. Niggas gotta step it up. <laughs> Damn, Greg, step it up, bro. Hey, Greg, just just put the bitch on there. <laughs> no, the camera. The camera. Like, <laughs> oh my god! Wow. I, I swear to I, on my on my life, I'm saying put the camera. Cause you said the camera. I swear on everything I love. And then you know I don't even talk like that about you in your face. Putting the camera on her. Like that. Hey, come on, man. The whole se- the whole whole segment, we're gonna get that angle. Dumb, can you do a split screen? Just show her <laughs> on this motherfucker the whole time. Smile. Don't look at her. Look right at that camera. Oh, my. Nah, nah nigga been blaming her the whole time and it's her. Nigga, we been trying to put on the camera. She hates this shit. She's oh, a photographer. Man. She she shoot movies. She get footage. Right. Nigga, she's behind the camera, bro. So calm down, Salter. Whatever epiphany you have of her. Get it out your sick ass, demonic <laughs> ass mind. Moving along. <laughs> oh boy. Aaron713 said, we really gotta blame now for these late ass episodes. <laughs> <laughs> Could have just told Eddie about low. Man, shut up. <laughs> He's tired of that shit. Victor Smith5996 said, Y'all let Nav trick y'all out of a six-pick win. Should have stayed with Murray. Y'all would have hit. Look, both of them couldn't pick Murray anyway. <laughs> That's true. Dad still would have fucked up some way. What was your pick? And Yvette had Murray at first. Yvette had no, Murray first. Dad had Murray Dad, first. Yeah, Dad did. Dad did. Let him, let him go. <laughs> <laughs> well, fuck <laughs> 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 Nigga, it's plenty of shit I tell you to do. You don't fucking do it. <laughs> now you want to listen? <laughs> <laughs> Money PT4511 said Nav ain't lying about that uploading Never know when the fuck this shit dropping <laughs> Well you right James Hathaway 51, 54 said Nav went from shift leader to Stephen A. Smith You a motherfucking lie This shit on nigga <laughs> <laughs> This motherfucker right here where you need to see it Now what my shit is like <laughs> Bro, that nigga Steve ain't get mad. You don't see none of that motherfucking shot in that head. No. But no, we just had to start taking it more serious because we got more eyes on us. And Dom just said it's time to goddamn level up. That's why we brought in uh, Reggie Ball and got Dot Net off that motherfucker. Because <laughs> <laughs> um, niggas weren't going to never take us serious. Just got a Dom bomb, breaking news. Trey Young and Scotty Barnes have been named to All-Star team. Scotty Barnes get there. Oh yeah, that boy hurt. Yeah. Scotty Barnes hooping. We shit. We said he was gonna be on that motherfucker. Mm-hmm. See, that's why we need the goddamn. Trey gonna get MVP of the game. Oh yeah, he got he something be to prove. Firing. They got... damn down like <laughs> he don't give a so? fuck, bro. When he get in, they not he gonna firing. put him out, dumb. He gonna try getting. You gotta think the players fuck with him. Storyline. On the East, it ain't too many niggas you can pick. But Greek Freak. East got East gotta win. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Definitely the East gonna win. Cause Greek Freak. That nigga, 
He the only nigga who played defense the whole fucking game. <laughs> he gonna be mad at them niggas. Man, play D. Yeah, hey, nigga, this all star nigga. This, this ain't no real game, bro. Yeah, this ain't no the real NASA's game. The NASA's gonna be on there. Yeah. Hey, I'm anxious to see this court, bro. You know, yeah, they're the doing LED the LED screen, court. Yeah, yeah cool. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna say Luca. I'm gonna say I'm gonna get Luca the MVP. So you got the West winning. I got the East. I like the West. East side. Yeah. East side. What you got, Greg? <laughs> Come on, tell me. I'm gonna tell you who fault is gonna be, bro. LeBron. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all got mad at me when I was getting on LeBron, bro. No, nah, LeBron, oh, not... my LeBron, my favorite player of all time. But okay. I didn't know LeBron when he in the game, bro. It, hey, bro, we ain't doing all that shit. <laughs> We ain't doing that. We just finna shoot. Nigga like, man, damn. The last East vs. West All-Star game was 2017 in New Orleans. The West won 192-182. Oh, yeah, because it is going back to East vs. Yeah, West. Yeah, yeah. I just realized that. Mm-hmm. This is the first year having it back, huh? Mm-hmm. Then with the East, you got Halliburton. Halliburton, he can't wait to make, get by 20 assists. That's oh. y'all boy, ain't it? Home Y'all cooking. switch up on niggas quick. That's what he gonna do, for sure. Yeah. He gonna get that assist, bro. Taking y'all picks done had me sick five weeks in a row. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Kershawn Spencer, 1267, said, bur, bur, broken play. <laughs> <laughs> Ed 3140 said, how the fuck he find his man? Shout out to Kwame Brown, man. Oh. Hurley's <laughs> underscore world said, hey, Nav, I see that diet is really working for you. I see you slimming down on us. Love to see it. Keep it up. Yeah, I just be going to the gym and getting smoothies. Uh, it's, just a, it's just a change because I'm going to tell y'all the truth. When Stephen A. Smith did that rant on Twitter, he said, I'm going to address this fat bitch. I automatically thought he was talking to me. <laughs> <laughs> so I started my health change then. <laughs> He was talking about Jason Whitlock. Yeah, everybody on his head. Bro. Yeah, but they hate Jason Whitlock. You don't know who that is? He, he used, used to be on Fox Sports. On, yeah, yeah. And ESPN. He was on ESPN. He was on ESPN, bit. too? Oh, damn. We got some voicemail? Uh, play it. Let's see what we got. Audio E, cue it up. Did Audio E go to the game? No. Eric, it's only playing on the headphones. One thing, man. You get my money back, but we're gonna you. Thank you. Play that again. <laughs> Run it back. I just wanted to let y'all know, prize is a fraud. I presume Goon folks got five assists. Hey, he got one in the fourth quarter. What in the fourth quarter? I know one thing, Pride P. You can get my money back, or we're in a lawsuit. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if he was drunk or schizophrenic. <laughs> Both, bro. I don't even know what player he said. I don't know. <laughs> I think Siakam or something. I don't know. Yeah, Siakam, he don't really be caring about assists like that, bro. Last week, our prize picks. Speaking of that, bro, Jalen Johnson has been becoming a little lock for me. I'm fucking with him. I'm 12 and 7 now. I had Jalen Johnson over 16 and a half points. The nigga had 19. Dom had Siakam over 30.5 points, rebounds, and assists. He had 31. Bro, that half, that point five? <laughs> when you, bro, you feel like you won a fucking goddamn trophy when you got them <laughs> yeah. catch that ass by point five. But boy, when you lose by point five, Ooh, you hurt. think the whole world against you, boy. <laughs> it is. Marcel had John Collins over 21 points, rebounds, assists. He had 25. Shout out to Marcel. Four in a row. Jalen Brunson on the 32 points. Reggie had. Wow. Damn right. Right at 29. That was a great That call. was he a been call. cooking. So. And we tried to start with yeah. him. Like, you sure yeah. damn did. We said, what's the name they playing? Reggie was like, <laughs> that nigga was right. All right. Right now, we four for four. Dad. Colin Sexton over four free throws. Less. The nigga had six. Six makes. He said less than four makes. Yeah, he yeah, said he less than four. 
But in that defense, bro, them free throws, that last two set came so late, bro. Really? Yeah, they I sat there and watched. They fought. Sometimes they be fouling at the end of the game, bro. For no reason. For no reason. And not just that, Reggie. Bro, in college, this is what's starting to make me mad with college athletes. You niggas don't hit y'all free throws. You niggas can fuck Ben up for everybody in the fucking world because you're not hitting your fucking free throws. You niggas get in the bonus at 10 minutes left in the game. <laughs> And motherfuckers go four for 73 at the free throw line. And a nigga got the over. That shit hurt, bro. <laughs> Enough of that, though. So I don't really fully blame Thad for that. Yvette had Lori Markakin. How you say your name? <laughs> Lori Marketing. Marketing. Markakin. Over one and a half turnovers, he had none. Now, the only question I had with this... <laughs> Yvette, do you have you ever seen this player play? So what was your vi- put the camera on her so they so they won't say, <laughs> damn nigga, she was talking, you ain't even put the camera on her. Put the camera on her. Wait, we ain't gonna let her talk to the camera on there. Crop, crop dumb out. They're gonna say we hate it. <laughs> I mean, I couldn't go with my original pick. Because we were saying that it was probably going to fall through. And basketball is just like not my thing when it comes to picks. So, But I'm saying. I, I thought it was going to be like an easy. Because I was looking at his record and stuff. I was like, okay. I feel like he'll turn it up. Because he was doing a lot of turnovers on his, uh, on his uh, little. So you be looking shoot. at the recent. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. So that's where you got your vision from. But you yeah. never knew about that player. I don't know who that man is. Okay. I, I respect your honesty. See, that's accountability. Something that Thad can learn. Instead of pointing his motherfucking finger around the room. So, we're going to start it off with you since the camera already on you. Okay. Oh, yeah. Let's do football so we can have Super Bowl picks if y'all don't mind. Okay, yeah. That could make it fun. We'll do it. Okay. What's his name? Isaiah Pacheco? Fuck. What's that? What's what's all the laughter? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. That's your bag, though. Running back. So I yeah. That. Rush yard is over. 67. Love it. Five. Love it. You love that? I love it. I could put it on mine. Oh. What you what you got? I, I, like what you what you looking at? Cause I'm not trying to get in nobody's business, but if you not putting at least 50 on there, don't worry about it. <laughs> no, I have some. I have oh, some okay. prize picks. I got some promo funds. Okay, because so, Thad, I would not. You put $10 on it. Right? Thad put $10 <laughs> on some shit and going to cuss me out because my pick didn't hit. Motherfucker, so what? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I will give you the $30. <laughs> you want to put 80 on it? Oh, sh- no. Oh, damn. No, I got some. Man, <laughs> hey. You, whoever said, Salter, you right. We need to start keeping baby girl on the camera. Baby girl getting her money. Baby, no, girl ain't, baby, girl. baby girl ain't scared to spend her money. It's not mine. Come on, man. Just you ain't got to say all that on the camera. Sorry. <laughs> all right. So, yeah. You got that. Who next? Hello. <laughs> I'm going to tell I'm going to go. Brock Purdy. Fuck, bro. Over 12 and a half rushing yards. That's a good one. Mm-hmm. I like that one. That's what you call potential. All righty, Marcel. I mean, what's the worst with Brock Purdy? All right. Kill him. All right, man. Hey, her. confidence is key, bro. You're right, you're right. You're yeah, right. all that whispering, come on. All right, you're right, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> then we need to skip you and come back to you. Let <laughs> you get yourself together. But 
<laughs> you out there is a pessimistic spirit. <laughs> I, don't, I don't want this on the pitch. If that has some, if that, you know, we're pumped up, Don yeah. we're pumped up, then you come. All right. <laughs> no, bro. Come on. That's why we be losing. The spirit don't be right in him. I got you. I got you. I got the prize fix shirt on. Let's go. Yeah, let's, yeah. let's talk some shit. All right. I'm going to take the under, though. Okay. On, on George Kittle. Receiving yards, 47 and a half. All right. Wait, wait. <laughs> what y'all? Come on, we're a team, man. What y'all think? I don't know, bro. Confidence is key. Confidence bro. is key. <laughs> you said less. Oh no, bro. Let me look at his stats. Hey, bro. give me uh Rasheed Rice, uh over 49 and a half receiving yards. Is that, no. Is oh. that low? Oh wait, no, uh, that, that's why the green thing on there. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, that? yeah. That's like the easy thing. Yeah. yeah. That's like the bumpers. Yeah, you don't win no money like that with the with the green one. Valdez Scantley, over 19.5 receiving yards. That shit went up. That shit was at 18. I like that. I like that because you know what I'm saying. You gonna Another get one target. or two deep balls. Yeah. Pause. Um. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> go, go ahead. Reggie ain't that good job. Hey, <laughs> good job. I just feel like we talking football. You ain't got to pause this shit, bro. Man, it, it's 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 damn near uh, a reflex. Yeah. It is. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <man. laughs> Watch that shit hit. What you got, Marcel? CMC over 23 and a half fantasy score. I like that one. How y'all feel about over one and a half receptions? Noah Gray. Nah, he don't be in. I like the under in his or Watson yeah, the under. Yeah, I I I done peaked them before. Them niggas is real. It's like Pat Mahomes be seeing that shit. Like, okay. I ain't throwing to them niggas. Okay, I'm gonna pick the under on Justin Watson, one and a half receptions. Okay, I love that. Yeah, we're gonna win. We're gonna win. I love that over the kill them. Cause that's all pretty no. Yeah, for sure. Uh I'm gonna go just cause I know this is what they need. I'm gonna go Kelsey receiving touchdown. Word. That point five. Yep. I'm gonna take. The I like one. it. That's a good one. Good job. <laughs> uh, Kelsey. Uh, over. I don't know that George Kittle may be all right though. Looking at this, uh, the over. I don't know. He had 81 receiving yards against uh, Green Bay, and then 27. Against <clears throat> Detroit. Let me see the last time they played in the Super Bowl. All right, all around the room, we need to know. I say we do our six pick, but we also do a two pick. Yeah, let's do some basketball. Let's do a two pick basketball just to build up build up the funds. A two a two pick insurance. Pick. Hedge bets. Yeah. All right. Basketball. Yeah. What y'all like then? Who said you were the one to give it up? You ain't been hitting like that, though. <laughs> I do. Uh, the best record, Marcel at 10 and 5. Uh, <clears throat> I would say Vet at 9 and 7 because I'm at 12 and 7. <laughs> hey, you, the nigga who recorded always say everything is recorded. Like, yeah, nigga, you in charge of the shit. You like the nigga who played the nigga who played a banker in the Monopoly. Nah, I be, I, I keep it, I keep control of the money. I bet you do. I got, I got, I got it. One, I got one for you. I got one for you. Do yeah for the two pick so we can build up funds. Do Isaiah Hartenstein. Basketball, NBA. Yes, ma'am. Uh-huh. Bill Ellis. Yeah. 
Yeah, let Greg do a lot for basketball. I'll do a lot for basketball since I'm on the streak. Yeah, we yeah, and Greg two Greg picks. good at basketball. Did Don pick? So Greg, what are you thinking? Jimmy Butler for I don't I hate Playing Orlando, Jimmy. right? Four and a half rebounds seems pretty low with Jimmy. Um Banquero. Over five assists. And one more. I'm gonna do Isaiah Hartenstein less than one and a half turnovers. Put a hundred on that. <laughs> do a power it's gonna be a power play. No, no, no. Do a power play, put like fifteen. This is a little, we're doing builder. We gotta build the bank up. Uh I had No, I had uh Kelsey to score a touchdown. They gotta show Taylor Swift. He gotta got right, them. Send a, yeah, send a script. Send a motherfucking script. No motherfucking script. And for the Super Bowl, I do like the uh, Pat Mahomes. MVP? Chiefs. Better believe Yeah, it. for sure. Who you got, Greg? Yeah. Yeah, well, nigga, uh, a point? <laughs> now you gonna Basically, make no a pickup. Yeah. How much you putting like that? How many units? Huh? How many units? How many units you put? No, I'm gonna go. This the last football game. I'm gonna go all in. Go crazy. Yeah. Might as well. Ball who you got? Super Bowl. Kansas City. I so that, that's I'm a sweep around the room, bro. Kansas City? No, no I picked uh, Kelsey. Travis Kelsey, Kelsey to score a touchdown. To score a touchdown. So it's under receiver. It's under rushing receiver. Yeah. Receiving and rushing. It's all, it's all in the work. You see it, Yvette? No. Go to. Uh, go to rush, receive TDs. Rush. NFL. As y'all can see, baby girl, not the best reader. <laughs> CRCT. Wow. Throwback. You went back. <laughs> yeah. Triggering. Nigga, them graham crackers and orange juice. <laughs> I remember mean, my dog thought that shit make you goddamn focus. Like, bitch, you can't read. Nigga, it don't matter what you eat, nigga. <laughs> graham crackers and orange yeah, juice. Yeah, that orange juice. Y'all had the little white cartons with the green writing on them? Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. But I had that one good teacher, bro. She would walk back because she wanted us to do good. She was like, mm-mm. <laughs> that's hard. <laughs> that's, that, hey, that's love, boy. Like, bitch, I teach y'all. Y'all niggas ain't finna be out here getting no bad ass grade. That's love. Mm-mm. <laughs> <laughs> you got to know the chain that Elsa, man. But yeah, this is the week of the Super Bowl, man. All hands on deck, man. We we all like the Chiefs. We all like Pat Mahomes. Free Pat Mahomes, send your nigga to his backwards. Right <laughs> along with it, nigga. Free young thug. <laughs> Straight up. Fanny Willis, if I find out you had something to do with getting Pat Mahomes' daddy locked up, bitch, I ain't voting for you. <laughs> Mm. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Y'all know how we do on them last bets. This the last one of the football season. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, Definitely. Who? Man, that's just that voice. He just light skin. Uh, <laughs> uh Yeah, Lord, we come to you today thankful and grateful for the Broken Play crew, the Broken Play prize picks app that we do weekly. We know we have lost in the past, Lord Jesus, but we know today you have blessed us with a new day. A new day has been made by Lord, by the Lord Jesus himself. We thank you for being our Savior, Lord Jesus, and we thank you for giving us these picks to place today. Now, each player that we have picked, Lord Jesus, may you please grant them the best of the best in each category, whether it be mental, emotional, physical. Please bless these players before they enter these games, Lord Jesus. And 
whether we place over or under. Let them feel the All right, Jamal Bryant. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Yeah, bro. Yeah, you might as well go do the team, bro. I was really praying. That nigga y'all. playing, I'm thinking <laughs> no I'm finna go play. That's enough. <laughs> God, if you see, if you see fit, we win. Let it happen. Thank you, God. You doing all that? <laughs> Come on. I'm like, what? Are, who he praying for? He praying for these niggas emotionally and all that. Come on, man. <laughs> on that, uh, on I'm gonna talk to you later, Lord. <laughs> well, amen. <laughs> on that note, man, uh, uh, if we don't win, you see why. <laughs> <laughs> Had the wrong person in the driver's seat. Uh, <laughs> but nah, man, this is a good episode, Super Bowl episode. So, you yes. know, next week we got to talk our shit. Chiefs versus 49. Kyle Shanahan. Versus Andy Reid. Young versus old. Cause, you know, Kyle, like a. He like you, a like, you like the over 47 and a half or under? Under. I like the over. All big games have been. Boy, man, I, I like the over. You like the over? Yeah. Chiefs I think Chiefs going to slow that game down. One thing about Chiefs, Chiefs will goddamn milk that clock, whether you like it or not. Them niggas know how to goddamn take that time off. So I like the under, but I, I really love the Chiefs money line. I don't know what I'm going to do on that over and under, but I really love the Chiefs money line. And that's going to be my lock. That's the lock. Lock, lock, lock. Yeah. That's the house? Chiefs, let's go. Bet in the house. Pat my own. I got to get the money back. Yeah, Put my money back where it should have been. Ain't that what them old niggas say? <laughs> <laughs> Start using them. Yeah. My uncle say a lot of shit, man. Any uh, closing remarks, Reggie? Mm. We got to have a good QB one next week. Yeah, Did y'all watch the Pro Bowl? Hell no. Nah. Yeah. What, what the fuck do I they do? Fun. Well, I, do not, I do I not. I do not watch cool. that shit. Dodgeball. Never. I, like that shit. I was all college basketball, all NBA. Yeah, I don't watch the Pro Bowl before, but it's been a long time, yeah. bro. I watched it. It was fun. Nigga, I want to say it was like back. I know AB was Black football. AB was in a Pro Bowl the last time I seen it. So it's been a minute. Shout out to AB. <laughs> Do you know AB be giving out uh Cracker Awards? <laughs> you saw that? I saw he said I missed that Cracker talking about Ben. Ben Ben Ros- Ben Big Ben. Yeah. He he tweeted that. Yeah, he crazy, yeah. bro. Yeah, he out there. He crazy. Yeah, there. <laughs> hey, you know how sometimes. <laughs> You had me like <laughs> this nigga tripping. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I felt like uh watch uh, like uh, that nigga uh on Django. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> what? Hey, luckily A B ain't trying to be no goddamn uh, on no sports show. He ain't trying to be on Fox Sports or ESPN. Cause nigga, it's gonna be hard to clean them tweets up. Oh, God. <laughs> Facts. Oh, hell yeah. He can come over here and talk Damn that right. shit all day. We was supposed to get him for the show. What happened? Yeah. That's hard. That'll be good. Yeah. Oh, I don't give a fuck whether he come or not. <laughs> <laughs> I want him to come talk that shit, but like if he don't, he ain't going to make a break. I, we got to get Pat Mahone daddy, though. I'll go NFL offseason, Pat Mahone daddy, Debo Samuel. Solid. That's solid. Solid. Them two solid. Cause you know Debo gonna come talk his shit too. Debo. Boy, 49ers fuck around and win. I feel like so many people on the Chiefs, I feel like the 49ers may just win that shit, bro. Yeah. Uh, That's what it's just I don't know. Well, I can't bet against Pat. If they win, Debo get MVP. That'd be dope. Where's he from? South Carolina, yeah. South Cacalac. South Cackle, oh, yeah, motherfucking lap. Who are an usher performing at the Super Bowl? Everybody waiting on that. I ain't going to lie, I'm watching. Lil John. I'm watching. I'm watching. You better be there. You and Luda. What was y'all, what y'all think was the best halftime show y'all seen for Super Bowl before we, before we leave? Prince? Prince. Beyonce up there. Nigga, I'm going to go with Dr. Drayton. Uh, yeah, all that shit. Yeah. 
I ain't pay attention to that one. For real? Yeah. Yeah, the yeah. nigga put on the show. Nigga! <laughs> <laughs> I'm tripping. Rihanna. I was thinking. Man, man, she did good, bro. It, bro. I was thinking it that wasn't was the best show. one, it, bro. She was pregnant cool. and everything. She but was, that, pregnant. That, that was still it was cool. Fire, it was fire. I just love to see Rihanna. Nah, that's why I said I Beyonce, Beyonce up there. Too. Yeah, I just love to see. Who you say, Marcel? You done got mad at all I picked. <laughs> you better say some shit worth saying. Uh, Beyonce New Orleans was good. Yeah. Bruno Mars killed it as well. Oh, he was he fine. Snapped. Yes, he was. He yes, he Dude. did. Uh, <laughs> thank you for tuning in to, <laughs> to another broken leg. I'm just saying, we done said Rihanna. This nigga talking about, nah, Bruno killed it. <laughs> Bruno. What do you do? Hey, Bruno. 24 carat? Nigga, I don't want to hear that shit. <laughs> hey, what the women at, Bruno? Who you was singing to on the motherfucking song, man? Beyonce was a, a part of the Bruno performance, too. She was? Yeah. Oh, I don't. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, shit. Well, that was, that they was take both my picks. The weekend show was Oh, yes, oh, it yeah, was. Oh, yeah, that was. Yeah. Hey, Drake yeah. gonna come soon. Yeah. Stop. Hey, we'll be back <laughs> next week. Make sure you. I, I hope the mic was off and y'all didn't hear what the fuck Dad said. And I, man, oh man, I'm surprised you ain't asked the goddamn sexy red ever before at the fucking Super Bowl, nigga. Nigga said did Sierra. You got the goodies, man. She got the goodies. <laughs> <laughs> Did she bring out Beat It Pablo? <laughs> Drumline. <laughs> uh, Keisha, her makeup. <laughs> <laughs> Katrina. Hey, man, it broke in play, man, where well, you can come and say whatever the fuck you want to say. Hey, if this episode don't come out in a timely manner, y'all know what to do. <laughs> Damn right. At Good Eye Media. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll be back. Have a great weekend. Watch the Super Bowl. Drink responsibly. And when I say drink responsibly, don't leave no more liquor in the bar. Amen. <laughs> Straight up.